Hi, I'm Tom Ruller. I'm the director of the New York State Archives, located here in downtown Albany, New York. I'm standing here in front of the Cultural Education Center, the home of the State Archives. The Cultural Education Center is located at the south end of the Empire State Plaza on Madison Avenue. State Archives protects and preserves and makes available over 400 years worth of New York State's colonial and state government records all available for you to come and do research on. The State Archives is located on the 11th floor of the Cultural Education Center. We're open from 9.30 in the morning until 4.30 in the afternoon. Parking is available for pay on either side of the building. If you come to the building, it's located right here at the south end of the Empire State Plaza. If you're using a GPS and want to find our facility, our address is 222 Madison Avenue in Albany, New York, 12230. Let's go inside and learn a little bit more about what it means to get into the State Archives. You'll enter the Cultural Education Center via the Madison Avenue entrance. Once you enter the main lobby, proceed back to the security desk and take the public elevators located to the right of the security desk to the 11th floor. The first place you'll go when you come upstairs to the 11th floor is our registration desk, here. We'll ask you to fill out one of our research room registration forms. It's important that you bring a government-issued photo ID in order to register to use the collections here at the State Archives. There are a number of rules connected with using the research room. You can't bring a backpack or bag in. You certainly can't bring a pen. We do ask you to bring a pencil. If you don't have a pencil, we've got some to provide to you. If you do have items that you bring with you, we have lockers here at the State Archives that you can use. We'll give you a key. It'll secure your goods, your belongings, and you'll be able to retrieve them when you're done with your visit. Well, now we're here in the research room. You've already registered. It's time to start to look for records. But one of the things that's really important for any researcher that comes to the State Archives to use some of the 26 miles of material we preserve for New Yorkers is to prepare for your visit. It's very important that you visit our website prior to your visit. Look at our online finding aids to identify the materials that will satisfy your research question. Our website, www.archives.nyse.gov, under the Search for Records tab, has an abundance of materials that will help you identify the specific items that you want to look at. Prior to your visit, it would be helpful if you filled out one of our records request forms and had it available and sent it in to our reference archivists prior to your visit so that we can pull the materials from our stacks and make them ready for your use. Some of our materials are located off-site, so it may require a couple of days notice for us to be able to pull those items. Here in the research room, we also have a number of items that are ready reference. We have a large collection of microfilm and microfilm readers that you can self-service use without necessarily needing to request them from an archivist. But again, looking at the website will tell you whether or not the records you're looking for are on microfilm or are still on paper and need to be pulled from our stacks. Once in the research room, we'll assign you a desk, one of the tables, and you'll be able to look at the materials at the desk. It's critical that you look at the website and equally critical that you talked to a reference archivist. You can do that well in advance by either calling us on the telephone, 518-474-8955, or sending us an email at archref, A-R-C-H-R-E-F, at nyse.gov. Our reference archivists understand and know our collections very well. We'll be able to connect you with the information sources that'll satisfy your research inquiry and will make your visit productive and useful. So here we are in the secure, climate-controlled stacks where we preserve and protect 400 years worth of New York's documentary heritage. These are the official records of New York's colony and state, preserved and made available for you. Researchers don't come back here. This is a secure area, and again, it's climate-controlled to ensure that these records last as long as they possibly can. That's our fundamental mission here at the State Archives, is the preservation of these critical resources. There are 26 miles of records here. That's why it's really important for you as a researcher to come prepared 
to be as specific as possible so that we can identify the boxes of records or the microfilm reels and make sure that they're available for you and make sure that you have the tools you need in order to find the information you're searching for in those records. Visit our website www.archives.nicid.gov. It's critical that you look through those finding aids and find the box of material that's going to tell you what you need to know. Call us 518-474-8955 or send us an email arcref at nicid.gov. Your researcher's records request form is the key to unlocking the secrets and the knowledge that these materials hold.